River State, where the police have failed to produce the detained PDP governorship aspirant Farad Agogo in court for the second consecutive day. The federal lawmaker has been behind bars since the 28th of April 2022 when he was arrested in Port Harcourt for alleged cultism. Senior reporter Uji Okoro reports. Farah Dagogo, representing Dege Maboni Federal Constituency in the House of Representatives, was first arraigned before the magistrate court on the 29th of April. The prosecution accuses him of hiring cultists to disrupt the People's Democratic Party screening exercise for state and national assembly aspirants. It is a case that has elicited mixed reactions and left many people suspicious that the defendant is being attacked for his political affiliation and ambition. With the jurisdiction of the magistrate court still being debated, fresh charges were filed at the state high court. But for the second day in a row, the police are unable to bring him to court on health grounds. The matter state versus... Dagogo Farah came up this morning for plea. Unfortunately, he was not produced in court. And his lawyer informed the court that uh, he was in a drip. But from the information I got from the police, doctors were still consulting us to the prospect of bringing him to court. I can't speak about his medical condition because I'm not qualified to do so. It's been two weeks since the River State PDP governorship aspirant was remanded in police custody. What is the personality involved? The matter mentioned in court for the first time today. So what is the person? What, what person are you talking about? The matter came up today for the first time in the high court for plea. And the accused person was not produced. So what person are you talking about? The defense team declines to comment on the matter. But Farah Dagogo is expected to take his plea during his arraignment at the state high court on the 16th of May 2022. Uche Okoro, TVC News, Port Harcourt.